Thanks you for watching this video, please comment your ideas below to help me make more interesting video for you. iPhone 7, Tips and Tricks You Need to Know The iPhone 7 has some flaws but at the same time in some ways it's the most intelligent smartphone on the planet. It can do some truly incredible things. So we are sharing iPhone 7 tricks that you need to know. Number 1, Smart Wake. It take them a while but Apple has finally introduced Smart Wake. Turning on in the settings and as soon as you lift the phone up the screen will turn on. Number 2, Storage. Apple made a lot of noise about the iPhone 7 audio and it's true the speakers are fantastic the sound experience you get from this phone is one of the best. But what they didn't mention is that the music software has also become more intelligent. So there's an option which ones ticked will automatically delete songs that you've just not played in a while to free up your storage. Number 3, Instant Camera. Swiping right from the lock screen instantly opens up your camera. Number 4, Quick Toggles. With iOS 10 Apple putting much more emphasis on 3D Touch and it works also on the iPhone 7. To start with using 3D Touch on something like the settings bar will open up a Quick Toggles option we can skip straight to battery, Wi-Fi settings, and more. Number 5, Flashlight. Instead of needing to open up a separate app simply pushing into the flashlight button you can decide how bright you want it. Number 6, Lock Screen Widgets. It's amazing how many people didn't know that you can now also swipe left from the lock screen and you've got widgets. Apple finally introduced weather widgets, stock widgets and all this sort of thing and you can customize your feed the way you want to see it. Number 7, Edit Live Photos. iPhone has a feature called Live Photo which doesn't just capture one frame but a small video and iOS 10 on the iPhone 7 is the first time you can now customize those. There's nothing revolutionary but we've got the crops and we can apply filters. Google has announced an app called Motion Stills and this allows you to thread them together to add stabilization to turn them into GIF or even export those movies. Number 8, Lock Screen Conversation. You can finally reply to messages from your lock screen using the Force Touch. Just hold down on a message and type away. Number 9, Hide Bloatware. Possibly the bane of every smartphone user is inbuilt software we hate it. For the iPhone 7 you can actually remove it now this doesn't quite delete it but what it does it hide it from the home screen and with no notifications on it might as well not exist. Number 10, No Spam. iOS 10 automatically detect when you are on a mailing list. It doesn't work 100% the time but I'd say probably 80% of the time and within iOS you can unsubscribe so all these spam emails you keep getting it pretty much sorts out for you. Number 11, Magnifier. iPhone 7 now also doubles as a magnifier. If you turn on in settings and every time you triple tap the home button it'll just zoom in on something if you want to read a faraway sign or just some very small text, it's pretty handy and the resolution is high enough for it to actually be much better than the human eye. Number 12, handwriting. With this smartphone Apple is kind of trying to make the phone more fun to use and my favorite features is the ability to turn the phone sideways when you're texting and handwrite your own message. Number 13, raw image. The camera on the iPhone 7 is amazing but as well as all the hardware improvements Apple now also allowing you to take raw photos. By using raw you can get better quality images. Number 14, prioritize downloads. If you've got multiple things downloading simply force touching on one of them and clicking prioritize will make that on go first. Number 15, Gallery Search. The new iPhone is much more intelligent and this is probably one of the best ways to demonstrate it. If you actually type things into the album things like trees it will find relevant photos. This works through Siri as well so you could tell it I want to see photos with grass and it can do that you can tell I want to see photos taken in the last hour and it will show you and it works pretty much 100% of the time. Thanks you for watching this video, please comment your ideas below to help me make more interesting video.